Human bodies. Hi, human bodies. I love the human bodies. What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing today? Never been better. My little oh, spooksters. My little spooksters. I got How? a new uh, road pro, uh, procaster thingy, and so I don't have all my buttons and sound effects. So I oh, no. For everyone. It's got default ones. I can. Oh. There's, there's like that. <laughs> like, I can't do. There's. It's got a rim shot built in. That's good. What is it? Can I do? Oh, that's built in. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, Here no. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's great. We need oh, like no. a. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, so that's that. Is this one better? Oh. Hello, hello. Oh yeah, that's fun. This is fun. Yeah, these are all fun. Fun is word. These are all fun. I'm testing it live. I, I've not tried Great. this before. A, this is a good time. It's the right place for it. Yep. Um, is it like a GoXLR? Is that, is that what you have? It's a it's a road uh, thingy with fader. It's a Roadcaster Pro too. So okay. It's got the built-ins. Yeah. Yeah. Road. Oh, yeah. Pro two. So, yeah, it looks a lot like a a GoXLR. Cool. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's for Go XLR people who, you know, can't get that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Eternal Darkness. At the heart of my soul episode, who the hell knows? We're making our way through hey, Eternal Dick. Darkness. It's probably uh, shy under 10. You okay. know? Not, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Um, nice. We're playing through this game. Uh, it's not aging as well as I would like it to. Uh, same... I think it still is. It has its charms. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sure, we'll go with that. It does have its charms. I think it has its moments. I think the pros still outweigh the cons. Yeah. But nevertheless, we're going to struggle our way through. I want to say we're on the back nine at this point, um, and we'll see what the next step is. I. Let's see again. I hear the silence from Dan, and look, it's, it's a blessing in disguise. No, I'm doing research. I saw someone say that the Mitch in this bitch clip on our Twitch has 10 times as many views as the second most viewed one on our Twitch. Yeah, it's yeah. got 31,000. Uh, yeah, I just shared it in chat again. I was of course it does. It. It's and I'm going to share it. That's it's, amazing. Yeah, it's huge. Oh, wow, it does. Yes, that is a very popular clip. Yep. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, you leave Jesus out of this. Um, <laughs> Sorry. The wind bag. <laughs> Windbag crash. Yeah, it's it's definitely windbag more the windbag exactly. than it is Jesus. I want to be mm -hmm. very clear yes, about yes. that. Um, and have you ever seen them in the same room at the same time? I don't think so. No, it's not. No, very true. Neither them or him or the side host either. Uh, what the fuck am I? You know, there's a part in this game uh, involving the observatory, right? And I feel like by now I'm in there fucking around and doing stuff and I've yet to fuck around in there and do stuff like I don't have Here the required is. equipment I've got a fucking heart I've got the essence of Mantarok but I don't oh, yeah. and I got a fucking revolver just like a a real old school traditional 1970s police issued revolver like the one from the end of Predator 2 that the Predators give to Danny Glover out of respect yeah exactly um, yeah 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 what the f Okay. Well, look. We're oh, look. It's a bleeding wall. It's fine. What look. did we do last time? Okay. So uh, last time we 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 spent way too much time in the uh fucking I forget which lit chapter was, it was it was. But we did. Was we, it the big boy? Uh, was it? There were a couple of them are big boys. You know. Right. Like let's be honest. Uh, a lot of hefty fellas in this game. Boop. Oh. Oh wait. Chat can help. The thing no, they, that the, the Roberto chapter introduced was Roberto. survey in areas. What? So you could survey things now. Can you oh. survey things now as this lady? Hold on. I just want to check out these books for a second. Where no. The, where the, normal oh, human oh. would stack books that way. Exactly. Well put. Um, what the, okay. I think maybe the one place that I haven't unlocked that we keep passing by, aside from the observatory, which I think I need a crank for, is this uh, outline of what's clearly a door? Thanks, Chad, for just being pals about that little 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 taste of a clue here. All right, let's go through nice my spell folks. list. Um, I made Tim Turry play through the entirety of Doctor Hauser for the 3DO for my amusement over the weekend, and uh, so I, I got a lot of survival horror this weekend. Doctor Hauser? Weird yeah, by the makers of that. Overblood. It's the makers of Overblood, but from 1994, it's fully 3D, not pre-rendered backgrounds. You can play in Whoa. first person Whoa. or third person tank controls. It's fucked up. 
Wait, which which one did we unlock last time? Who, who, who uh, did... No, no, I don't think it was a spell. I think it's a, it's like a skill to survey things. Oh no, that's not. Is that a thing? I don't know. If that's what Ch Chad said. They were helping by saying that. So oh, fuck that, dude. Yeah, See, here's what I'm struggling the most with. Right, I'm struggling the most with like. I know I finished this game when I was, uh, you know, I guess. Oh, we I lad. I, pl I played this when I was like maybe 21, 22. I don't understand how I figured this out. Unless I was cheating. Unless I yeah, read I a mean, guide. It could have been. You just poke around. You think I was just there? I, was, I mean, I probably played it 95% stone too. So like. Well, then yes, the you day. were more, yeah, chemically lubricated. Yeah, I'm, I'm not stoned now. I, I can't smoke during the day or, or eat weed during the day. It's just not for me during the day anymore. Maybe if I can't it's do it weekend, if I have to interact with humans. It's just way too much. Yeah, it seems yeah. like it seems like you have enough caveats where you should probably just not be doing it at all. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of enough rules. That? I see with the Z. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this yes. game looks yes. messed up. All right, so we're surveying. We're going to try and survey something. Um, okay, fella. What the fuck was in here? I forget. Up, oh, just another stupid room. So, I forget how the surveying worked. It kind of just like... You just like walk just up like, to it and press A, right? Like it was prompt. Con it's like it, it was, was context sensitive, as yeah. they would have said back in the day. Yeah. Excuse Eat me. the weed. <laughs> Eat the weed. Oh yeah, I yeah. do. If you can, if you've got the means, eat the weed. I mean, that's look. Weed. I'm no doctor, but eat the weed. Okay. Ever seen Bob Backlund going on his moral crusade? <laughs> I have never eaten marijuana. Just fucking eat the weed, okay? Really eat the weed. Be a big adult and It'll eat the weed. It'll sneak up on you if you eat the weed. It sneaks up on you. I'm just saying, it's probably the cleanest way to ingest it. What the fuck? Wow, mm -hmm. this camera's just like whoa, 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 yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. just a just a wee bit jarring. Just a so wee there, bit. Someone says there was like a, they thought there was a pile of rocks somewhere in the house that you could okay, survey. Okay, friend. I don't, I don't remember a pile of rocks. Is that I maybe know. in the basement? Oh god, look at these freaks. Oh, now we're having like a proper circus in here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's missing the Benny Hill music. Is there uh, a better word for the infinity symbol? It looked like those folks were doing the infinity symbol thing. No, infinity just... symbol's perfect, bud. Maybe it like an amoeba cool, strip like... sort of thing. I'm like... sure. It, I bet it has a name. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. What's a Mobius strip? Mobius what is strip. That? Sorry. Yeah. That's just like an illusion that can, looks like it continues on. It's like this the impossible Limiscate. loop. Limiscate. The Limiscate. What's it called? Limiscate. L e m n i s c a t e. S c. Wow. Limiscate. Limiscate. That's not as cool as I was hoping. There's some fucking. Weirdness going down here, gents. Oh. Yeah, someone was just like huffing and puffing. Someone was real need, needed their uh, inhaler. inhaler. Yeah. <laughs> someone took a bite of an apple? What? Yeah, what the, what the, I crunched a rat, I think. If anyone wants to check out today's arcade pit, it features me and uh, Jeff. No, Grumbo I don't think we're, we're not. I think we decided not to put it up on the website. No, I, there's going to be a VOD up there soon. Uh, it's myself and Matthew of Botchamania yeah, against it, the it, Arby's fellas. You really embarrassed yourself, so I thought you didn't want to put it up there. Well, I mean, hey, look, I, I just like people to see the content, so yeah, it's up there. It's going to be up there for fish folks. the entire time. It was very, yep, yep. very off-putting. I wouldn't watch it. <laughs> okay, enough about you, Dan. This is my show now. <laughs> well, just, hey, we're on the Giant Bomb family, you know? It's all about all of our content. Mm. Let me see here. Oh, take a huff. Take a huff and puff here. Let's let's think this through. She's all like, right, Jesus, there's see. so many fucking stairs in this house. <laughs> <sighs> Dude, I am fucking done right now. What are we doing? Well, we got to find the next chapter, right? I know. So, that's uh, what this game is. So God you learned damn. to survey, and you definitely unlocked some magic spells that you probably I can't use so. Somewhere. I mean, like, uh, I keep going back to this little spot, I did, but I didn't try a spell. I don't think at any point have I known what's happening. In yeah, this yeah, game. we know. We know. We know. Okay. Um, <laughs> I just want to make that clear. Reveal Invisible feels good. I mean, come on, I earned that. 
<laughs> it's not even with the right. We get it. There's something in here. But we don't know how to get in there. Fish? Fish? <laughs> Is that a clue? Yeah, Satan's just yeah. Is that no, you, Satan? Satan? Fish now. That's a helpful clue? Fish. Oh, wait, what, what did that say? The circuit has been broken. Maybe it's a circuit? Where the fuck is this? Okay, so... This fucking game is pissing me off. Okay, so... Do you have the Gladius? You do, it looks like you're running around with the Gladius. Where did you get that from? Oh, I don't know. Okay. Well, we gotta find the room where you got the Gladius. Okay, okay. Let's... Hold on. Chill, 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 chill. This is a Gladius. Yes, a sword. Gladius? Gladius. Gladius. Irrelevant. What matters. Oh. What the fuck? Ghost just carrying pistols down. It's just the like the ghost of Yosemite Sam. Just yeah. fucking. Alright. Is that. I... Whoa, where's my sword? Oh. Okay, I think I got like it in the back. on top of it? I mean, maybe that's just. Say what? Say what? There's like a blue tint on top of the game right now. I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's a that... little. It's, it's the game. Okay, it's, it's yeah. being that way. Alright. What the fuck did I, where did I get this here? You eat it. Okay. You too. And you too. <laughs> See, now the tint's gone. That was weird. Uh, I want to say I got it in uh, Grandpa's weird back office. All right. What? I think, I, okay, Look. let's look around in this room. Oh, what was that? Oh, yay. Look at that. There's so much of this game that I that like I, I I'm in the spot and then I just leave. And right. I mean, because modern games wouldn't be that finicky about it, right? Or they would be they would have something shiny to show you you should be here. So you're I just guess. used to playing games that way. You've been doing it for the 20 years since this came out. You're right. You're right, Jeffrey. A lot, a lot more quality of life these days. Yeah. Yeah. They're worried yeah. about our QOL. That's it. You know, I've been playing that Bayonetta 3. It's got that R3 thing where it just shows you where you're going. Just hey, yeah. head in that direction. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Good time. Oh, we got like a butcher. He's a butcher. Ew, he's just like chopping this body up for no reason. It must remain and guard back then. I didn't have like the internet. Yeah, back then. After that, the Guardian may return to its lair. Our master does not like failure. It is imperative can relate. to keep the binding intact. Then we have to find more flesh and bone. What the fuck's happening? He's, he's, he's playing worried, a fish. His worried eyes there. Well, that was a that was a plot point, I guess. Uh, all right, chapter. 53. The war to end all wars redefined uh -oh. how mankind looked at war and the value of human life. Right. two time. Here we go. Oh, We're the on the war to end all wars. <laughs> Thanks, Meatwad. <laughs> um, oh, it's still so on. Some okay. <laughs> some it's like, why does my laugh sound like this? Damn. Okay. This takes place 100 years ago. I'm into it. In trenches. But I found the account of a certain Peter Jacob. Of a certain Peter Jacob to be the most horrible of all. His implication about the ancients' involvement with the war was hideous Spamazax. and so obvious. <laughs> with the horror of the Battle of the Somme scant miles away mm -hmm. and the distant echoes of pounding artillery. Scant. So wartime. This is Peter World Jacob War One here. Researched his latest stories <laughs> from old times. <laughs> His grim World War One was like a bad one. Yeah, this is, this is not. Like, wasn't this not World War One? Yeah, this was one of the better ones. What's 1916? <laughs> They're like mustard gas sucked. Yeah. I find no solace in the purpose behind all the senseless violence that surrounds me. Young men die. It's a smart game. Be like, hey, what if we just set it across time so we can reuse the church asset over and over and over. It's yeah. like really smart, actually. Yeah, I mean, good use of resources. That GameCube disc was tiny. Yeah, right. I love One it. gigabyte on there. Love that thing. Yeah. You guys know what medium that is? Like, uh, Yes. Isn't it uh, Sony's mini CD? Uh, close. Mini DVD. Oh. And Dreamcast was GD-ROM, right? Yeah, GD-ROMs, which I don't know if... I think those were just CDs. Really. Yeah, GD-ROM. Yeah, I, so. I got... Yeah, spoiler. That shit was just CDRs. <laughs> it <laughs> sounded cooler. It did sound cool. Game discs. 
Yeah. Is that, is that what it stood for? I bet it's what it yeah, probably. Oh, shit. World War One's popping off. And I'm just a wee lad. Let's examine. Oh, I don't want to read that fucking shit. What are we doing? I don't know. Like they are, they're not just CDs. They have held a gigabyte. They were... But they were Yamaha, not Sony. Yeah, but Sony. you could... Yeah, but like... You could were, just put a CD in. Yeah, yes, absolutely. Yeah. I think they read just like CDs. Yeah. Do you remember when they would send out like little free uh, CDs that would be tiny or shaped weird, like almost like yes. bubble-ish? And I yeah, got one from Pizza tray. Hut Yeah, they in were like Spain. People were using like a them piece of pizza. like business Sweet. cards. Remember that? Man, that time was cool. Was yep. it? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Physical media was cool? Just that general time, like late 90s, just pretty mm -hmm. good time. The, like the yeah. speed at which were so cheap to produce. Yeah. And yet we have like a marketing budget. So let's just do some dumb shit with them. Like, yeah. The, Wrestling. Speed, the speed at which like uh, capacity increased on those mediums was so fast that it was like you were just constantly throwing shit away. I feel like. I just remember VT Skell in chat says that GD ROMs spent the opposite direction compared to the way DVDs and CDs oh, spun. That's, that's made them in Australia. So yeah. Funny. yeah. <laughs> I knew that joke was coming out of your fucking mouth. <laughs> that's some Simpsons bullshit. What was I going to do? I was going to do something. All right, so Backlog, I think you got to win World War II. I think I thought you beat this level. Really? Dur even during the first one? Wait, I mean, World it would be, it'd be helpful one, if one, you could prevent World War okay. II. I think a lot of yes. people would be thankful. Yes, you could do okay, stop some 12 World monkeys War II bullshit. From happening. All right. Yes. yes. Uh, the only, okay, great, great, great. Well, we know there's a downstairs here, so let's keep uh, surveying. Go the kill upstairs. Hitler. He'd been alive then, right? He was probably like a little yes. baby. Yeah, kill him. Kill baby Hitler is the uh, objective. All right, so I can't go there. I'm already huffing and puffing. Perhaps that's why I'm not fighting in this war. Ugh. Wall time. Treacherous. Have you gone up? Oh, you can go. Oh, there he's not gonna let you go downstairs. Didn't even realize there was a dude there. Okay. Well, squish, 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 squish. Wait. So I don't. Do I, I don't have. Spells yeah. What is yet. that? What is the big glowy thing? Huh? The big that, glowy thing on yeah, the wall. Yeah, I checked it out. It was that? like it's like a thing, and you know, no one talks about it. Like, I got one of those in my house too. Yeah. Like this is in my basement. Yeah, you just don't go down there, yeah. It's a 7.1, which is real intimidating. Uh, yeah, it, it's. I'm obviously going to have to, like, reveal right, that. Right, but you don't have this, any 7-point spells yet. Right. Okay. Yeah, not, and not only that, I have any, I got to get the book first. That's what you got to oh, do. Oh, right, this chapter. guy can't do any magic. This guy's yeah, he's shit. he's useless. He's a piece of shit. Exactly. Yeah, he's a pipsqueak, yeah. Look at him. I hate him. He's the worst. His sanding meter's already all the way down. He hasn't seen shit yet, besides war. <laughs> besides pipsqueak war, when you come on. Back. Pipsqueak's good. You could, I don't think it ever back. went away. Yeah. You could you could use it. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Hello? I can't believe that was Dino Crisis in Arcade Pit. I know. I was going to say Clock Tower. It was just like, I'm trying to think of any games that could have those pre-rendered backgrounds. And I'm like, eh. There we go. There Dino we go. Crisis go. Just didn't look like it at all. There we Couldn't go. get into Dino Crisis. Hi. Uh, I don't think you're alone. Okay. You're no help. Okay, war is bad. This church Someone seems to be doing door? okay. No, that was just a uh, random gunfire outside. Okay. That's seeing him saving Private Ryan when the guy's getting all sad talking about his mom. Yeah, let's not, let's not let's not revisit that. It's a good movie. <laughs> I just watched it. It is it's good. Movie. Yeah, it's just, I don't hold up. War. Um, I don't think a lot of people like it. No, I know. I don't like. I don't like or uh, war as a genre. Oh really? Yeah. Huh. I like Band of Brothers a whole bunch because I'm a dad. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dad ass show. That is a dad ass show. What about like weird war, like Apocalypse Now? Are you into that? Sci-fi war. Oh, that one. That's uh, not sci-fi. Yes. It's no, just no, no, weird I, and trippy. I, I, yeah, I, I, that I can swallow uh, eat more easily, but sci-fi sci war is fine, time. too. I should try it again. I Grub, like I watched historical. it again recently, and I think it like might be the best movie ever. And what, Apocalypse okay. Now? It's immediately Bond's favorite it. ever, too. Yeah, yeah. Apocalypse it's, it's Now? 
Yeah. Yeah, it's very good. I need to actually rewatch that Full Metal Jacket. I haven't watched a lot of those rough war movies in quite some time. Yeah, we're going to do Full Metal Jacket soon. We've been on a Cooper really kick. Movies, we did Strange Love and stuff recently, so we'll probably do Full Metal Jacket. Man, Strange Love actually probably is the best movie of all time. It's I, fun. Yeah, I, I would Love support that, that. I would support that. It's a funny movie. What the? F what? What am I doing here? You're, just keep. Let's keep looking. Let's observe. Is it a crane let's mini work game? together. Yeah, crane, I have to yeah, pick up these, a, uh, you know, triage units and. Right, but it's uh, the the claw is rigged. It only works one out every seven times. Right. So I went up the stairs though. What else is there? Is there anything else I'm missing here? I mean, why is it? Why would I have you look around if it wasn't right? important? Fucking... Eternal darkness. You broke my fucking heart. You broke my heart. I, I got a good history with claw games. I can, I can win stuff pretty good in those. Yeah, I, I, I've had some... Like, when the claw is functional, I've definitely yeah. been able to get a lot of stuff. Yeah, but those claws are... They got a weak-ass grip. Let's be right. honest. They, they, well, they, they have... It really is one out of every 15 times or something like that. They work. That's how yeah. it... That's what oh, it is. Really? Yeah, it's like a slot yeah, they're, machine. They're programmed, they're programmed to only work every so long. Every I feel cheated! Yeah. Dude, guess what? Capitalism, baby. You are that cheated. Stuff, stuff is You're not regulated. supposed to be able to cheat! That yeah. Sucks. Yeah, it seems kind of. Yeah, but I mean, listen, it's, you know, it's like a carnival game where they're set up so you're not supposed to be able to win a lot of times. I don't like that. Dude, this is dark as fuck. I can't even. What the hell? Wait, what? Oh, I don't. Wait, what? Huh? I got. Ooh, I got to put that penny in something. Ooh, that's a lucky penny. That penny's going to go inside something. You got to smash it like you're at Silver Dollar City or something. Yeah, it's already got like a gash mark on it, so you know something's going on. Uh. Can I put it in a fountain? I'm you. I would like to use the penny. Wasn't there like a a, a bell string I was able to use? Here? Mm, okay, we're done in this fucking bell tower. What's this? No, I don't need to see all these fucking terrible letters. Oh. Strange echoes, ghosts, you got Restless it. Restless ghosts, my fears, I stare at his empty bed. Okay, well that was unhelpful. I don't, I'm not leaving, am I leaving? Okay. All right, and again, how are you so out of breath, my dude? We've all, we've <laughs> barely been moving around this I mean, church. his lungs have been destroyed by mustard gas, so. I guess, oh, yeah. he's not, he's already starting behind the eight ball here. Uh, there should be a, a place to pick up the let's see what they're called sealed orders have you looked at the sealed orders yet and they were I'm, um i'm gonna say negative on the lectern what the fuck's a lectern? the lectern in that main room right oh like the like the the, the podium 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 yeah so, oh that's zone a that's on okay, hold on. google google lectern the between lectern and podium yeah, why don't you just walk there, you little pipsqueak? See, I'm bringing it back, Dan. Yeah, nice. I appreciate it. Hell yeah. What about you? Can you help? Uh, a podium is a small platform on a stage. You stand on a podium. A lectern is the piece of furniture that often supports a microphone and usually has a space for a speaker to place his or her notes. Okay. You stand on a podium. All right. Got it. It also notes that many people use them interchangeably. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Such is life. Here we go. Here's some sealed fucking orders. Are you okay, hey, sir? Mitch. What, what, what the fuck's happening? It's Mitch! Man, I'm gonna start calling him Mitch now. This sucks. Yeah. <laughs> Are you getting Mitch in this bitch happening? Yep, that's gonna be the new chat thing when Mitch shows up. Yes, that rules, actually. <laughs> Mike, it's like I was it's just entrance music. Uh huh. I was just listening to it again, Mike. <laughs> Alright, so maybe now I can like show Yeah. I think you can show these guys and they'll let you go into Show my now. papers? Yeah, show your papers. Papers, please. Hey you got papers. Mitch in this bitch. <laughs> Mitch in this bitch. What the, wait, what Mitch the... in this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Mitch. You are Mitch. to leave your post of duty. Mitch. Mitch. All right, so I, I gotta I gotta Mitch. give these to someone else. I think. Yeah, try going in the basement. No, not the basement. I'm gonna That's go to the front magic door. Happens. Why does in Mitch know this? Mm. Happening in the basement. Happening in the basement. 
That was good. It's the bait. Wear your basement face. <laughs> you guys have basements? Yeah. I'm in it right now, baby. Oh. Yep. It's nice. It's finished. Great, right, actually. I got a bunch of these new weird bugs down there now that I've never seen before. They're like, oh, different, different they look seasons. like spiders, but then like when you look at them closer, I think they're just like weird crickets or grasshoppers. But there's like a billion of them down there. Do they have, do, are they like, uh, look up house centipede. Oh God. Those are dope. I hope that's not what it is because there's a lot of them down there. Let me see. They're good. They're good bugs. You, you, are they? Yeah, you don't, I don't kill them anymore. I used to because they're horrifying, but. Nope, that's not it. No, I it looks them. way more like a, uh, it's more like a cricket type thing. Oh, so you probably have crickets. Or si oh, silverfish suck. I hate those little. Yeah, oh, yeah, those. silverfish. Those yeah, it's not suck. silverfish. Okay. Yeah, you're right. House centipedes would fuck up crickets. Oh, the salamanders are back too. I haven't seen them in a while, but what? they're back. Oh, so, oh salamanders really? are great. Well, that's yeah, what happens when you live, uh, <laughs> in whatever country you live in. <laughs> you act like I live. You keep bringing up True Detective is where I live. Yeah, that's, that's Louisiana. True. Season that's on the one. Other part of the country. Deep, deep season one. <laughs> All right. Uh, stack like dogs. Peter stands before the price of human war. The bloodied corpses of young men who've made the ultimate sacrifice to defend their own countries. Their own countries and and those, those of others. others. I'm in the dark. I can't see shit. He's in the dark. Okay, let's get some fucking books. Ooh, going wobbly Show time. Show me books. Huh? Survey what? says what? books. What is... Huh? Oh, why is this floor screaming? Okay. <laughs> huh? Okay. Oh, that's good that hand's doing that. If you could get, like, half off the price of your house... But all the floors are like that. Would you do it? No. Yeah, that's a big. Uh, that's a big okay, risk. free house, free house. But you yeah. have to live there. Then and yeah, sleep there every free day. house, sure. Free house. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can stop screaming when I'm trying to sleep. Am I, I only scream when I'm walking on them? Am I allowed to renovate? Uh, like, what's the deal? No, you have to keep it that way, and you have to wear earplugs if you want to sleep. Oh no, it's not, no. A, dude. dude no. You know what else is a free house? The side of the parkway. Like, yeah. <laughs> Like, I didn't even want a house that didn't have a two-car garage. Like, I'm like, <laughs> no. like, oh, yeah. Um, but the forest stream, like, no, Dude. that was a non-starter. Since when are these fuckers agent. bulletproof? You got to look for deals, man. Deals? That's not a deal. A dumpster. I mean, I mean if it deal was. With, with the devil, maybe, yeah. <laughs> oh, this is such horseshit that I cannot shoot this thing in the face. I gotta remember to save my oh, go Oh, oh, oh no! Losing it. Oh no! Oh man, he is after you. Good. Or what you after them. Dude, what am I even doing right now? I think you, you're making progress. Am Slowly I? Surely. Hold you got on. a big. You got a gun. Yeah, I gotta put. I. I gotta. Mm. Now it's I have a gun that, the war. that is not being uh, useful whatsoever. Have you tried enchanting it? The gun. No, get out of here. Enchant your guns. That's what the. That's what the, they always say. That's what Second Amendment people say. Hold up. I think maybe I can make this reveal invisible super spell. All right, let's do it. I think that's wrong, but no, I don't have a seven point uh, tablet yet, so I can't. Um, well, shit's popping off, so maybe uh, everyone's abandoned their guard. Did you turn the boiler on? Get out of here! What are you talking about? We gone in the basement. Turn yeah, the these freaks are around. gone, so now I can go downstairs. Boiler, yeah, that's where fights happen. Isn't that isn't the boiler room where uh, they like do deals? And, yeah, it's where and, Giovanni like, Rabisi. Oh, oh, so yeah, Giovanni Rabisi and Mick Foley yeah. are down there. And, yeah, yeah, and Vin Diesel. Why is Vin yeah. Diesel? What, what, yeah. Why is Mick Foley there? The boiler room brawls. Oh. Mankind lived in the boiler room. Oh right, right, right. There. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. I should have known. Oh, Jeez, <laughs> that's from your time. I know, you I know, know, I know, I know. Know your history. Jeez. <laughs> Yeah, these seem like they were fun to reload. Okay. Um. Okay. Honestly, though, kind of does seem fun. Like just slotting each uh, bullet into their little, their perfectly made little very, slots. Very time consuming. Satisfying. Yeah. Oh, yes, definitely. But it's like a fidget spinner. Sure. Oh dear. What are you looking at? He's looking up, and I'm focused on this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't this where the death certificates are written? What, what is, what is that thing? 
Oh, he's looking at the blood. Okay. Ah, uh, don't mind the blood. Dude, we're used to the blood. Get used to it. Yeah, seriously, dude. It's like entry level eternal. So, uh, this is a big basement. We're probably gonna stumble across the boiler. Looks like this is it right here. Oh, we've seen this thing before. Yeah, we've been down in these guts. Yeah. Bum bum. Let's get some bullets. Open up the. This is the wine cellar door, right? Although Ooh. it's probably not wine anymore. Oh shit! Wine, wine's better when it's old, right? I just got trapped. And wine ages, yeah, that's what they say. But like, I so like, if you had a wine that. from the the eleven hundreds, it would be better than one you buy now. I don't right? think that's like one hundred percent the case. Yeah, yeah, that's not. It's not. It's like the way they age it, Dan. It's not just like wine that's buried in the ground. I thought, well, I thought people literally put them in cellars, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's like a temperature controlled, like special kind of like situation. How they age don't, it. Don't make I, me speakerphone, Mike Mahardy. Go for it. I don't care. <laughs> That'd be the least weird thing to happen on this program. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I'm totally aging wine in my basement now. <laughs> I'm Mike Mahardy. Oh, I know that guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like wine. <laughs> he does. He loves it. He can't get enough of it. Yeah, I, I just I can't drink the wine that he drank. I mean, I, I he has I'm sure he has good taste in wine, even though it's a fake, uh, you know, industry. But correct, a fake industry. Yeah, it's like the it's like the jewelry. Well, it's like the diamond industry. Yeah, the the, 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 the wine bullshit. tasting industry is like a fake industry. Yes. Yeah, hundred percent. Let me call it here. I think I think no, we, you know, we don't need him to defend the disgusting this wine industry. Okay, that's a word. Are you hearing that? Yeah, yeah, we hear this, but <laughs> you won't be able to hear us, but that's fine. Okay. You just you relay. Hey, what's up? Mike, you're live on GiantBomb.com. How are you doing? Oh, hi. How are you? Doing great. Hey, uh, wine, if you had like a wine from the 1100s and it's been sitting in a cellar, nice and temperature controlled forever, would it be better than any wine you had now that was from like 2018 from like a Savinian field or something? <laughs> the douchey answer is that it depends on the grape. Not all grapes age well. And yeah. Do she answer? Would... Oh. Yeah, that's that's my that's my answer. Like I, I don't know, you're not gonna age the Sauvignon Blanc that's aged in like 20 years that I know. Of. <laughs> God, Does Sauvignon Blanc help. not age hey, well? Not with that attitude. He can't help himself, not, man. He just as, as he slips into one. this guy. You okay. know. Can slips. you hear them, by the way, Mike, or can you only hear me? You're you're going out live. I can hear I can hear Jeff Backlar smarmy sarcastic remarks. Yes, nah, that's <laughs> not me, dude. What do you mean? Backlar called wine a fake industry, so if you want to let him know anything, you can. How am I hoping he's enjoying his life? Exactly. All right, Mike. Oh, touché, Mike. Touché, hey, listen, touché, touché. Mike. Me and you are wine guys now. We're not a, a beer dork like some frat boy no, like he, Jeff Backlar no, here. Oh, Mike. Mike and yeah, I are no, in that no, club. No. Come on, dude. Yeah, I'm glad you called me in a giant bomb to help class the place up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. Do you have any podcasts you want to plug, Mike? Oh uh, yeah, we do podcasts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a classy oh, show. Cut him off. Cut it's a classy off. operation over there, right? Oh my God. <laughs> Gotta pay for that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks, Mike. Appreciate it. Bye. Bye. All right, I'm glad he was able to, you know, that was basically teach you guys some culture. Yeah. yeah, no, we, yeah. we learned a whole lot of nothing there, I think. <laughs> wow, you are killing these dudes. They're not dying, though. Uh, well, They're not dying from least. me killing them. I feel uh. like this is a sanity effect room, though. Bro, you can't, you cannot reload while you're walking? What kind of a spat? Oh, my God. Whoa, what's happening? Whoa, I Whoa, think this I think is an coming. upsetting angle. Oh, shit. What was that? It was an orgasm. Did that zombie just come? Yeah, I think so. He came to death. <laughs> I'll pick up that torch. Thank you. That right, helps me. What? Control what? F. What was torch. that? Okay. What a weird thing. I say you're only on the third paragraph of this walkthrough if you just got the torch. Okay. Well, I'm I'm skipping around. You know, I'm doing my thing. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah. And we got we got till four. We're good. Human bodies. Human bodies with Mike Mahardy. 
I mean, he Th knows. This wine like, has a hefty and a hearty human body. Do you want to know why the wine tasting industry is bullshit? I mean, I, uh, yes, I do. Because whenever you go to a fucking liquor store, there no one's giving out free samples of beer because everyone knows what the deal is with beer. They're like, oh yeah, word of mouth, it gets around. Wine doesn't matter because all wine tastes good. So whatever the person is giving you in the store, you're like, I'll take some of that. I just had it. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's fair. I, I, I the first time I ordered wine, uh, they like at a restaurant, they poured it in my glass and just kind of waited. I'm like, what am I supposed to do now? I didn't realize they were. It's like there's a whole procedure of like, oh, you got to test the wine. I'm like, well, you wouldn't do this with any other drink, but it's like, oh no, the wine is special, and it's no, it's not. It's it just. Exactly. It's just like anything else. And there's enough, th I've seen enough, like, uh, you know, blind taste tests, <laughs> you know? But yeah, the blind taste test thing is what it does it for me. Like, I don't, I, I don't like the way all wine tastes, but like, if you sure. get a certain kind of wine, you, it's probably going to taste like that kind of wine. Uh, but in the blind taste test, the expensive ones almost never win. Not in any way that makes it feel like, oh, that's worth the extra price. Oh my God, get, oh my God, what am I, nope. Should I? Oh, I should be shoot. Oh, I might be fucked. I might be fucked real bad right now. Break Hold free. On. I'm trying. I want to break free. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Is that? I want to break free. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. I hope I didn't just really fuck myself here. Okay, hold on, hold on. Get away, lady. I, I gotta to save. Break I need free. to save because if I fuck this up, I'll be so bummed. Oh my god. Oof. We're safe. Help. I, oh, oh, my enemy through. mouse, how dare you, were, you? You weren't for the last couple minutes if you were talking oh. to us. What? Okay, hang on. I how? Think I can get that Sounds good. Enemy mouse saying I'm I'm drinking. Oh my god. I can't remember the last time I had a course light. Listen, I, was in I got nothing against Coors Light except that it's terrible. Yeah, I'm, I'm listen, back. We're, hey, we're Coors Light's fine. Yeah, drink. Course, it's it's tastes like every other beer ever. Yeah, it's fine. It's completely fine. Good. <laughs> Two I've been gone for a few minutes because uh, bringing Mike in apparently crashed my entire system. Uh, but uh, I hope you weren't saying anything uh, inaccurate. Or accurate. Inaccurate. Coors is great. Coors tastes the exact same as Bud. Tastes the exact same as Miller. Tastes the exact same as everything else. Totally. All that beer is the same trash tier. Like it was all like the one beer they could brew during uh, wartime when they had uh, only so much material to work with, right? Like that's how Pils Pilsners became popular. Yeah, sure, I'll go, we'll go with that. Are those all Pilsners? Or, or like Bud Light and Coors, are those all Pilsners? Yeah, I think so, right? I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure they're Pilsners. I oh, don't, okay. I'm not, I'm not exactly I, mean, I think sure. even calling them Pilsners is Modders. like doing all other beer a dis uh, disservice. Oh, look at this little guy. Look at this little guy. There you go, pal. Look at this cute little boy. Oh, look at these little guys. This is great. Yeah, loggers. 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 Okay. okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That's right, because oh, I put okay. Yingling in the same category as I should. Yingling is a lager, I believe. Yingling is good. Also tastes identical Yingling's to all those fine. Others. Yingling is like... Uh, it's it's probably better than... Oh, boy. He's in me, isn't he? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, oh shit. That's just insta-kill. That was just an instant right, death. Right, you've been taken over like all, like all the other people here. Okay, yeah. Dude, I'm so... Oh, I, I'm so happy I saved. I'd be so pissed right now. Yeah, but now we know how to speed run this shit. Yeah. Also, Pilsner has a time and place if you're, do, uh, if you're doing a long day of lawn work and you aren't cra looking to crack over. Is it like yeah, a light yeah, summer no beer? Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, is it like a light drinking thing? Yeah. Totally. Oh, yeah. None of that's heavy drinking. Although I do consider like a Bud heavy to be like the Marlboro Reds of beers. <laughs> you what know, does that like, mean? Like a Marlboro Red cigarette. Yeah, what does that mean? But what's that mean? I've never. I don't know. What does that mean? No, but just like the like just like a nasty like the the worst possible thing to do. Like if you're talking like, about the king of beers, it's the most successful beer. How can you how can you deny well, them that? Red's pretty successful, right? I mean, yeah, yeah, I want to see. Like, that. I, oh, Jeff's just a hipster who only likes things that aren't popular. That's so untrue. I I that's like the least true thing ever. I love things Ooh, that are popular. popular. Oh, it's sold about? well. Oh, it's universally beloved. <laughs> I don't like it. That's that's never come out of my mouth. You're just putting shit in my <laughs> mouth. You're just making things up. I Anyone... can't have it if other people like it. That's just not the case. <laughs> 
Poo poo, I say. Yeah, but that beer sucks. <laughs> so Sorry. I've gotten free for three years, so I love it. Huh? I've gotten free for three years, so I love it. Sure, sure, sure. You're just... I loved it before. Bud Light's always been delicious. Yeah, yeah. Look, so you, you, light, so. you got to make do with what you got. You know? Yeah. I was Milwaukee's best light man all through college. I probably had thousands upon thousands of Milwaukee's best lights, and I'd buy it in the bottle because I was a classy dude. Okay, okay, I'm reading up on this. Pilsners are basically pale loggers, which is, they're pretty similar anyhow. Ploggers. Pale they're ploggers. They're, they're, yeah, pl <laughs> they're, they're poggers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Bush the poggers of beer. Somebody should jump on that. <laughs> That could be. We should have a giant bomb beer, and it could be the Poggers of beer. Oh, I'd be. We into should that. do that. Yeah. Sell pint glasses. Got a partner. Yeah, we like just, just got a partner with a, uh, a brewer. For, for Christmas, like we yeah. got fans that do uh, beer stuff. Giant IPA. We're only doing an IPA. I'm sorry. Stone Cold got his own beer. We can get it. Oh yeah. Let's have the Stone Cold let's, guy let's do like, it for us. Let's like aim Elsa higher, Gundo. though. Let's like aim higher. People like that. Oh, is it not classy enough for you because it's wrestling and you're Dude, above it? His his <laughs> beer obviously was trash. I mean, he pour half of it. About Ninety. You're talking about Steve Weiser's, which is different from Stone Cold's Broken Skull IPA. He would that is a classy a El Segundo ring. brewery. That's a real deal beer versus 90 the Steve Weiser's of the beer that he would drink. In 1998, on the you're referring to. to the floor. I'm talking 2022. <laughs> All right. If you want to defend, if you want to die on the Steve Austin beer hill, be my guest. I'm saying I know what I'm talking about, and you don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Am I wrong? He's got a point. Thanks. Does he have an IPA? Yes, that's what I've been trying to say. Oh, well, I kind of... Broken Skull IPA. It's not the same thing You've had that it? he poured on his face. Yeah. And you like it? Uh-huh. I thought you don't like IPAs. I don't understand. I don't mind them. I'll drink anything. You know, I prefer not to taste them. Okay. What's happening? Steve oh, I'm in Weiser. a, I'm in a thing. I'm in a thing. I'm in a weird thing right now. I'm stuck. What the hell? <laughs> that was so weird. Oh shit! That's so cheap. Come on, guys. What do I do, Grub? What do I do? What do I do? All right. With the boiler, did you turn the boiler on? I don't think I've seen a boiler. Yeah, we were looking at the boiler earlier. Earlier, the big thing, the big machine thing in the basement. Here, right here. Yes. That looks like a boiler. Yeah. It's, Pipe organ. It's not. It's not interactable. Oh well, you gotta figure out a way to turn it on. Oh wait, maybe, maybe it's the pipe organ. I gotta fuck with the pipe organ, maybe. Who makes the the Steve Austin beer? El Segundo Brewery. Gotcha. Oh my God, you are. Getting, you gotta push him off. Yeah. Have you seen I, the commercial for Kevin Nash's weed? No. Pretty cool. He pulls into oh. a neighborhood with an ice cream truck and starts giving a bunch of Kevin Nash weed out. Dude, this Hell is yeah. this is bad. This is gonna <laughs> end poorly. I can't go back there. Mm, okay. Yeah, you're gonna have to load that save again. All right, let's see here. So, I feel like this. I feel like the last 25% of this is gonna be real, real, uh, real upsetting. Let's so, uh, you chat. got the two-edged sword. Use the sword to decapitate any bone thieves you find. Uh, you can also cast Spell 9, Magic Attack, while invisible to attack groups of them. Uh, the room under the stairs where Anthony uh, was has a torch and ammo. You've got the torch. Head back to the cathedral chancel and descend into the basement. Don't miss the Lee Einfeld on the altar before going downstairs. That's the gun. You have that. Once in the basement, investigate Brother Andrew's room and the other room built across, for, across his for ammo. Head over to the organ blowing equipment for more ammo and head into the wine cellar. The cellar has been expanded to accommodate a boiler room and a steam generator room. Investigating the two rooms, Pete will find that he needs to activate the boiler machine first, the room on the left. Then right. try to turn on the steam generator, the room on the right. All right, but here's the problem. Oh, there's not a problem anymore. I have a torch. I'm fine. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's, let's, let's fuck around here. Oh, not this one. Sorry. Take that! Bone thief. Take that! And you, That's lady! Oh they shit! Really this nurse means business. Yeah. Oh shit! You got me all turned around. Oh shit! Sorry about your head. Sorry about your head. Oh shit! You're in there. Simcos, the oh. chat asked, "Is it an organ blowing machine just called a flashlight?" That's very good, mm, Simcos. Very, very good. Ten points. Ten points. Yep. 
in the shit grub tonight. Dynamite, they're doing the daddy ass birthday bash. Okay, oh, well, I gotta watch that. I can't miss out on that. Oh my god, oh my that god, like oh my good, god. That sounds like a party game, a party video oh game. Oh my god. <laughs> Mario Party minigame. Yeah. Okay, hold the fuck on, ladies and gentlemen. What the fuck was that, by the way? First thing I'm gonna do also is just save right out here. I wanna get Windbag to uh, introduce himself. I was saying, fork me, daddy, Windbag. I think we should just steal that and make that part of his thing. Oh, okay, I don't need game, to do that, but whatever. That's important. I'm gonna enchant that. Oh, there's a lot of you. You know what? Hold I mean, on. He immediately just punched you in the gut. Too. He's just like, psych! It was crazy. <laughs> Uh, I need to, you know, I'm, oh shit, I'm, hold on, making, make, making energy, making energy, making energy, come on, come doing on. Doing the energy making doing dance, energy, everybody. Doing the energy, everyone now, everyone now, everyone now, here we go, here Do we the go. Bar go. The other way, the other way, okay. <laughs> uh, I need a shield. Shield me, daddy. <laughs> Fuck. What about a, what about a, a baby shield? Jack Bauer. Oh, does oh that sucks to suck, doesn't it, Bone Daddies? Oh no, look at you guys. Look at all you RGB. guys. RGB, yeah. Oh shit, what is happening? Yeah, green beat, green beats blue. That's right. Yeah. Green is better than blue. I, I like, don't know if I have an opinion anymore because I'm a grown man. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> What are you saying? I don't. I just. I don't know if I got so to about which which yeah. color was better than other colors. Green is better than blue. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. I think it's green. You, you get asked that question. Oh, what's your favorite color? <laughs> green. Green's the best. Yeah, it's my favorite color. Is it really? I think so. Blue's good too. I, yeah. I like gray. Oh, yeah. Orange is the best. Gross. Orange sucks ass. I think that's Spice purely orange, because of Star Wars. GameCube, so. number one GameCube. I'm that's a good GameCube. Way. Orange is a good GameCube, it's a bad Starburst. No, okay, what? What's happening, <laughs> oh. Jake Keller? What the fuck is oh. happening? Satan's all handcuffed there. Purple. Yeah. Purple is the best GameCube, I think. No. No, no it's Spice right. Orange. Yeah. Spice Orange is really good, but purple is the best GameCube. Spice Cube? Orange can be a purple any day. The and best, best Starburst is red. No. Orange candy sucks. Where did I go? What's the orange candy? Wait, I thought I was supposed to go into these two rooms. What the fuck is happening? One of them has the bread. Skittles are the best. Three scoppers are the best. They made a whole fave wedge because everyone wants red scoppers. And they fucked that up by putting the pink ones in there. And those aren't as good as the red. The pink ones are strawberry. The strawberry ones are really good. I mean, yeah, listen, I'm, I'm with you. <laughs> They're number two, Listen, listen, listen. I'm with you. But they can color them orange, and I still like the taste. Orange is bad. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. I didn't realize there were, like, hella doors here. Okay. Hey, pull the lever. Woo! It's been a, it's nice. been a minute. It's been a minute. There's hella doors. Now you go in the other room, I think. All right, hold on, hold on. Oh, shit. The circuit. All right, well, I don't have a fuse, I guess. No! Ooh, this one's bubbly. Yeah, turn the wheel. I can't, I can't use any of this shit. Oh, oh, I can summon a trapper. Okay, let's do something fun here. Cool. Grub, have you uh, Wait. done Star Wars stuff in Fortnite? Uh, no, I'm, I'm, I want to install it very quickly and or not. So I want to turn it on and get it going. Yes, because uh, I really don't want to miss out on the Star Wars. Oh, stuff. You have a cool. circuit or you have a fuse. I do. You're lucky, Penny. Oh, neat. Oh, fuck, man. I want to figure that out. Come on. Sorry, dude. I just didn't. I mean, I could let you figure that one out. My Wait bad. a minute. So I could just oh, my thing just plopped dead. I can't. Well, that's not. How do I get that thing? I don't know. I, I was in there as a trapper. 
All right, maybe that'll. You should be able to go through. I mean, that's a trapper made hole, right? I, I mean, but hole, you hole. didn't see what happened. Look. It, I mean, I saw you die. I don't know. Whoops. All right, look. Man, now I want Starburst. Oh, cool. Yeah. Different like, different camera angle now. Neat. All right, look at this little freak goes in the hole. Proud of myself for buying a big thing. No, no, remember we had all that big thing of candy uh, in Brooklyn, and I took it oh, home, and I was shit. like, oh, I'll give this to kids for uh, for uh, Christmas, or uh, Halloween is the candy one. Um, and so I <laughs> held on to it the entire time, didn't eat any. It was right there on my table. I was so proud of myself. Bonk didn't have any either. And then uh, Ben Hansen and Tim Turry came to town for a few days, and we just devoured the entire fucking pumpkin full of all that candy just drunk as hell yeah that sounds about right yeah, that's yeah, fine that's how it would go like down. like two days before halloween and then I oh didn't have well but we didn't have any that... trick-or-treaters so we're good oh right that's right that makes sense we had a lot of trick-or-treaters we had a lot come through oh yeah that's my first year doing it. it was it was fun it was cool getting pokemon cards they liked it yeah that's such a baller move right there yeah well, was, I, was, I looked out and i looked into it basically just saw them and I'm like yeah this seems cool nice they gave candy too, but they only cared about the Pokemon cards. Lucky Penny. The uh, the inner the uh inventory. Like, it doesn't show you everything you have at once. No. So it's like you have to scroll through things. I don't know if that's because like you're maybe like you would would have figured out the penny thing had it been right there on the top. But, I mean, no, you would have to scroll down and like think about it. Like it's weird. I mean. You know, the, uh, yeah, like you knew it was going to be used in some capacity real soon, and it's, it's all good. I'll, I'll, I'll get over it. Mm, let's see. All right, so we got the fuse going. I still, ugh, I still the, the, seven, you... the seven point thing that, uh, that I found in here. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, never mind. I know what to do. Okay. Yeah, so what happens when you try to beam that body? Yeah, that's not, that's not. Good. Okay. What? Maybe just move a little bit. Shimmy into the I middle of the room. I just did it. Yeah, we, we know for a fact video game that this works. Yeah, uh, video game. I'm the one making the rules here, okay? <laughs> I just don't remember. Oh, right. Never mind. Okay. The there Cosmic Fly says, uh, at the risk of upsetting most people, I'd like to state that red and purple are the worst flavors. The truth hurts. Oh. Now, is he talking about Starburst? I don't, what is a purple star? Okay, that's yeah, weird because that shit didn't two work. Flavors. Did you see that? It didn't I, work. Oh, wait, I think I have to target it. Hold on. Okay. Make an energy, make an energy. We're making some more <laughs> energy, make an energy, make an energy. Oh, uh, okay, so everything. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, red and purple, everything are always the worst. That's crazy, Cosmic Fly. Yeah, that's grape is great. Cherry's great. Cherry's good. Yeah. Watermelon's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watermelon's like pink, though. Dude, I've got enough energy. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh my god, this fucking this game just like it's it's trying to make me hate it. Yep. <laughs> it's like going out of its way. All right, let's go. Oh, cool! It could run. I didn't know that. There you go. There you go. All right. Open up that door. Let's get ourselves a fucking seven spell plate. Pick it up. Pick it up. And when you do that, you can, of course, reformulate all of your spells. Yeah. All right. So now I'm going to go back to the uh, church area. And um, cast that seven point reveal, whatever. Um, uh, is there. Oh, wait, there's. Did you fully look in that room? Which one? The one where you opened the door? I just want to make sure that we didn't miss anything. Uh, did you pick up. Because uh, you picked up the seven, the, the seven point plate. Yeah. But did, did you I pick miss... up a new spell? Oh, shit. I mean, maybe it's not in there, but I. I... Nope, just a bunch of duty. Let me, yeah, they'll be in there. Yeah. I'm not seeing anything. Uh, yeah, I don't see anything. Okay, oh, wait, all right. Wait. Okay. No, it looks good. Okay, all right, never mind. Go, go ahead, we're good. 
Thanks, Jeff. What a what a what a teammate. Yeah. What a one thing I like to do yeah, is anytime, to waste anytime. your time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, okay. Oh, right. There's still a war. There's still a war. <laughs> Ooh, I'm hearing some something juicy. Christmas. All right, Dan. What? Nothing. I don't need your help. Um, oh. Okay, first let's examine. I'm thinking it's the dis reveal invisible, right? Yeah, maybe, maybe dispel magic or something like that. Uh, uh it could be an. I've actually I haven't read ahead to this part, so I don't know. Um, all right, so we're thinking. Na Narakath Reg Reg Gormor. Okay. Yeah, Narakath Reg Gormor. Narrowcath, Regdormor, and then just power, power, power. Power, 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 power. Wow. That's a mouthful, folks. Wait. Someone said Twizzlers aren't a boomer candy, are they? I'd say like wax bottles, circus peanuts. Twizzlers are... Everyone loves Twizzlers these days. It's hip. These days? Why do you well, say like that? I mean... Because they're saying it's for old folks. I think the kids are hip to the Twizzlers. Right? I think Twizzlers Grub, are kind You guys of... got kids? Do your kids like Twizzlers? Yes. Really? One of you does, yes. Okay. Grub's doing something right. Wait, I mean, so Dylan doesn't even like Twizzlers? I think he's had it, but I just don't think he, like, prefers it. Is he a Red Vines guy? Because then I'd, I'd have some no. respect. Okay. So Dylan just has no taste. Okay. No, he likes, um... He likes, like, chocolate. He likes M&M's and... No. If you call Twizzlers licorice, then I'm yeah. like, oh yeah, licorice sounds like, oh, yeah. we're gonna we saved some money during the Dust Bowl. Let's go down <laughs> to the corner store and get ourselves some licorice as a hey, treat. Licorice kicks ass. Yeah, except you know black good? licorice, which no, actually yeah, but black tastes licorice, like fucking like, hell. I don't like black licorice, but covered in chocolate and salt from Iceland is good as hell. All right, I mean, that does sound good. That. But yeah. also, I just like regular black licorice. Ew! Anyway. Oh, it's like Robitussin. What are you doing? Yeah, it, it tastes just like bitter awesome oh i need a handle okay cool what a cool part of this wiley wallaby <laughs> that's the best licorice from australia they have green apple and strawberry Ooh, that so sounds good. good i would do oh green apple licorice you did turn on the boiler and you got the organ working right so can you do yeah, anything with the me, organ let now let me play that shit Oh shit, it's all fucked up. And you're using that fucked up controller too, so you're gonna have to really make yeah, that's this not gonna be fun. Hold on, out. I gotta like fix this. Uh what do I, I have to cast the spell? Oh on yeah, it, can right? you repair it? Maybe enchant it, you think? I don't know. Look, look for your spells. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong spell. My bad. Sorry everybody, wrong spell. Can you cast the healing spell on shit? Uh I'm gonna enchant this first. Nope, I'm not. Uh Maybe. No, wait. Uh, I guess we could just guess the music, right? I mean, we could. Just yeah, but it's not letting me notes. play it. Oh. Oh wait, the generator. Wait, how do I restore? I thought the fuse box restored the power. No, I think you. I think you got the power going, so I think you had to go into the other room and and actually turn it on. He's fucking oh, hey, here the that. whole time. He's here the whole time. You can tell. Uh, well, this is, I was gonna say. Tell us it's America, but this is definitely not America. Um, I can put a gun on an altar. The joke still works. Yeah, yeah, thank you, thank you. Um, so presumably, oh wait, I think one of these was like a real dark ass room, or no? I was gonna say because there's, there, if if the organ needs power, there's got to be a way to turn it on. Right? Or the, I've, I've I've exhausted all my options down here. I think. No. I've, uh, well, well, where is the organ thing? Is that the organ thing right there? I pulled that lever, so like that should work. This thing. I don't think you've turned on the organ yet. Like, because I, I mean, it says yeah, the, it no, it says we didn't turn right. But I need. I don't know how to give it power. I mean, we're, we're, hang on, let's. I don't know. 
I'll pull the lever again. Oh, maybe... Now you put the thing in, right? So maybe now... There we are. Yeah. Okay. Good, good, good. Good job, good job, good job. Let's get into trouble, baby. Wait, did you... Wait, is, now is the organ... Examine the organ. Let's just make sure that yeah, it's... Yeah, I gotta go back up. Examine the organ. No, I mean the, the, the thing down there. Oh, the, the uh, boiler organ? Yeah, whatever. This is the big machine here. The Borgen? Yeah, let's, I just want to see what it says. Yeah, it looks, okay. looks... Yeah, it looks, looks good. Looks All right. Okay, I think the organ's organing. Yeah. Examine the organ. Oh, yeah, he's, like, clutching yeah, his clutching chest. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Was that... Oh, that was just war. Yeah, it's just normal war. Yes. I guess that could be Cthulhu. Cthulhu. I guess I, could, I should, like, kill all these fools? Mm -hmm. I suppose. Let's go. Oh yeah, you guys are just Oh doing yeah! That. One shot, two kills. A B Y X. One shot wonder, baby. Yeah, Let's baby. go. Yeah. Like, 360 no scope that music. Like Mike Minotti and Back to the Future NES. Yeah. <laughs> what do you know? An ear. Whoa. Oh boy. Okay, you fuckers. Get me out of here. Oh shit, fuck. Oh fuck, shit. Oh boy, I'm in trouble here. Um, I can't cast, I don't have time to cast something, right? Oh, oh. oh no, he's got me in DDT. Uh oh, it's dangerous. Well, if it's like 1987. You're just eating my shit, stop. Dude, th that break free button, not a thing. All right, hold on. Oh, there's a ton of these fuckers, huh? All right, wait, 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 wait. Chill, 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 chill. Chill, chill, stop, stop following me. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh shit. Oh, I got one. Oh, I got another. Oh, you fuckers. Oh. Come on, don't be like that, don't be like that. Chop your fucking head off. Chop your fucking head off. Oh, not so cool now, are we? This cool is what they're going for. Yeah, they're not exactly trying to get into like a party, right? It'd be like a weird eyes wide shut thing. Yeah. Fidelio. I got the handle, right? I, I did. Did I not? Oh, I didn't pick it up yet, motherfucker. <laughs> Hold on, let's save. Can we save? Can we save? No, we can't. The darkness is still coming. The darkness is upon us. Give this game a score from zero to ten. Uh, in the in two thousand one, it's a nine. Okay. Now it's like a six. Okay, that's, that's fair. That's what I am, Dan. Fair. Fair. Yeah, I think it like a, it would be like a three out of five for me today. So I like it's the it. the same score. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mitch says it's too much of a time tax. Well, yeah, there's a lot of like going back and forth and mindless bullshit, but uh, I, think there, I think there's a good, I think in this 20 hour game, there's a good seven hour game. Okay, that's a good way to put it. You know, it doesn't have a time tax, and it's more like a fine Cabernet Savignon. Is uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2006? I've heard good things. Yes, it's only aged gracefully. Yes, I've heard good things. All right, what the fuck is Some bullets? Mitch says I'm also admittedly more resistant to old game bullshit than others. Me too, Mitch. Mitch, I think we got some things in common. He's a GameCube man. He He's a gamer. The same person. Gamer's gonna game. <laughs> no, are you kidding? No, I'm not. I think Mitch, G Grub knows both of us. Yeah. Grub says we're similar. Maybe me, yes. me and Mitch no, are similar. No, but Mitch is like I've way better right years. years. He's a wrestling guy. Yes. He's a GameCube guy. Yeah. But if they're both yeah. the same person, like I'm taking we Mitch. Got, they Beards? Both, um, they're both and loud. And we're, uh, yeah. they both, people love to see them mad. Um, yeah. Wait, what's my version of, the, of Disney, though, where it's like he's got the Disney thing that I hate. 
Right. Do yeah, I, I mean, have something that Mitch hates? Well, I'm sure, but I'm, it's not like it's 100%. Like, it's, I mean, I guess all I like is video games and wrestling. I was going to so. say, like, anything you don't understand. So, what is that about? I like, think I understand most things at this point. Right? <laughs> Just let that one marinate with everyone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm a movie guy. I'm a movie connoisseur, I would oh, say. Oh, wow. Mitch, you like movies? Yeah, Mitch, yeah. Is Mitch, that a, what are your thoughts on movies? It's a little niche thing I'm into. Yeah. I think Mitch usually doesn't watch many movies these days, except for like the, except for Disney ones. Movies are okay, he says. Uh, okay. Well, see, I, I, as a connoisseur, as a college oh, educated as film major, right. uh, yeah. that movies is maybe something okay. I, I do hold over uh, Mitch, yes. You know, movies are just okay. I actually, yeah, I mean, we're in the we're in a new renaissance of television, so I agree, Mitch. Movies are just okay. Nah, TV movies is are better than TV. Uh, movies are better than TV. Well, I mean, at one point, I agree with you, but in the year of our Lord no. 2022, I think TV is better. No, they're too uh, indulge, self indulgent TV shows the these days. Drama TV show I've seen in the last two years is that new Dragon show. I'm trying to think if I've seen any other drama shows. Oh, yeah, so you're the last place drama to... show I watched before. Oh, Succession. I love Succession. Yeah, That's awesome. Yeah, That's a comedy, I think. I consider that a comedy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You consider Succession? I mean, I guess there are elements of yeah, like, so dark comedy. Is it like a black yeah. comedy? 100%. Yeah. Yeah. But, but it is not when, a comedy uh, first. No way. Fucking Kendall did that interview and he's like, I just don't see what could possibly be funny about this. How, what is so funny about these situations? Yes. And the joke was he didn't get it because Succession is yes. fucking hilarious. Yes, of course there are funny parts of that show. I would argue there's funny parts of any show, of anything. Like, but it's a center. drama. It's, it's a drama first, for sure. There's I great TV. First. I'm not saying that. There's a lot of great TV right now. I just there's also way, way, way more self-indulgent bullshit that like it's like we're just one big movie that's ten episodes long. Well, you gotta watch I the think, whole thing. And I think like, I'm where so you're over coming from. Stuff. I understand where you're coming overacted, from. and where, uh, yeah, where you're coming. You're, you, you are you are yeah. you're criticizing the delivery mechanism that in my opinion lends itself to that kind of storytelling i i am big on serialized tv i love serialized tv it's just i don't think there's a lot of stuff in the last like five or so years that's really grabbed me you it's know fine. Yeah, yeah, when i try like, to watch stuff there's I, just I, like, I'm, so I'm, much content it's like i'm like yes. watching the americans right now and i see it's good but yeah. also it's like i don't know it's, it's it never really reaches high highs that a see, movie hits for me it's, see, what, it's actually what the answer is for me i couldn't i couldn't get there with breaking bad either I right, I, it's, I, I love Breaking Bad, but I, I can totally, at this point, I, I think going back to it now, I would be a little bit less enthralled with it. I never saw Better Call Saul. Better Call Saul is even better. I point. keep hearing that, but I've tried to watch the first season like three different fucking times now, and I've gotten like six or seven episodes in and been bored, you know? Okay. Like, I, mm -hmm. I think it's, it's well made, definitely, and I've heard it gets better, but I just, uh, I keep trying, and I, I can't do it. Oh, what? I mean... Hey, don't force yourself. Yeah, I'm gonna pick oh, up my. Oh, oh cool! Here it gets good. Look, oh, that's look what I collected. <laughs> this is like when Hulk Hogan picked up that fake puppet Hulk Hogan head. Yeah, this is the Hulk Hogan reference right here. To be or yeah, not to be. Yeah, I won. I beat the game. <laughs> Man, I don't like how his eyes are looking there. That's pretty shitty. It's happening, brother. Oh, you're a big boy. Okay. Let's, uh, let's maybe like enchant this fucking gun. First, I would say Succession I've probably been more invested in than maybe any movie I've seen. Yeah, I think they just, did they just finish recording season three? Yeah, they put out teasers for season, season four. four. Oh, they did? Season yeah. four, yeah, yeah. I love... Yeah, uh, I don't remember that sanity effect either. So yeah, me neither. That might be my first time seeing that. Okay, I am just getting insta-killed. Yeah, he is uh, drinking you. Something fierce. Okay, let's 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 fucking yeah. Let's uh, let's let's regroup here. Let's regroup. Let's have a good half hour of power and get through this level. All rise. All right. All right. I mean business now. I'm standing up. Yeah, okay. Ooh, all right. I've stood. I've stood. Okay. He's assuming the gamer position. Appreciate if everyone the at home position. could also stand. Well, I'm gonna use the the massage gun. Tell me if this is too loud. Yeah, it's always too loud. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> oh, you're that's like the Ferris Bueller song. Don't don't <laughs> You gotta do the oh yes. Oh yeah. Chica, chica. Yeah, I didn't have a planner for
appreciate it. Hot Project killed a man. Matthew Broderick killing a person is uh, a sanity effect all of its own. I think. <laughs> does he? How many people is he killing, Ferris Bueller? No, he just. I think he's only killed one person in real life. So. I mean, that was a reckless car drive. You know, he yeah, could have thrown over some people and hit the cutting room floor. Oh, yeah, that's true. Oh shit! I left weapons. Uh, wait, people are saying he killed an actual guy. Wait. Yeah, he killed an actual person. Yes. Uh, wait, wait. During the what filming of that. No, no, no. In just just normal everyday life. Here, he, Matthew he Broderick. Wait. My man are, like getting, right? vehicular Slaughter. manslaughter? All right. Really? Matthew Broderick was charged with vehicular manslaughter in 1987 after he was involved in a car accident that left two people dead. Oh, jeez. He was convicted or something? He was convicted of a lesser charge of reckless driving for the incident. Uh, oh, I don't geez. know if he was drunk. If he was drunk, he probably would not have. I don't. I honestly don't know. The, <sighs> he was drunk. I always drunk, worry well. about that because I'm not good at driving. And it's like, what if I just because I did something stupid, somebody died? Like, I would hate that. Yeah. Oh, yeah? You'd not yeah. like that? No, it'd be the worst thing that ever happened. Yeah, no shit. I, would I hate bet that. that's the worst thing that ever happened to Matthew Project too, and to the people Probably. left behind. Yeah. Uh... Oh, that's satisfying. Oh shit. I gotta, I gotta prep here. There's a lot yeah, of. Yeah, he was facing five years, and then he got a lesser charge and a one hundred dollar fine. A hundred dollars? Feels like maybe, feels like maybe there should be something in between. A uh, hundred pounds, excuse me, hundred pound fine. It feels Isn't like there should be, should be something between, yeah, between here that and the other thing, like five years in prison and one hundred pounds. What is the deal with like if like famous people like getting less uh, charge? It's just like a judge, just like how, how do they hide that? How do they hide uh, like oh you're just no, getting no, less they don't charge? Hide you just get you have better lawyers usually. Oh yes. money. money, money, yeah, still a mystery how mm -hmm. the world works. Well, a lot of parts of it, yeah. But I mean, when I mean, you explain you know, it, it makes sense. You know, beautiful people do like you consistently and statistically get lesser sentences. Uh, too, so, you know. I don't really get, like, look, I'm I don't, I've never <laughs> had, like, court cases with myself involved, but, like, I don't understand, like, paying for a better lawyer, well, it's like, isn't the evidence the same, and, like, it's just, like, is yes. it just a charisma but, thing? It's like, no, oh, I got Johnny Cochran, and he's charismatic, yes. and don't said you, some funny don't stuff. Don't you realize and... privatizing the entire uh, judicial system has uh, resulted in uh, inequality for for justice? Yeah. Is that just us? Is the judicial system in other countries? No, not? it's it's human We're nature, private. right? Like, it's like, you know, if a good lawyer knows how to play the system and throw, uh, you know, gunk into the works and confuse things and uh, muddle the the prosecution that that would work in a lot of places any place that has like a, a you know trial by jury that should that would work um is that the com is the jury thing a big common thing everywhere yeah in a lot of places yes okay. this is him getting off of like just saying i understand everything about me. <laughs> <laughs> oh what's cool is i could just step on these little guys that's kind of fun Oh man, do yeah, I hope uh, I don't. So, like, for okay. example, OJ Simpson did kill her. And he well, got yes, out. 100%. Yes. Is, 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 Cochran was charismatic, right? I, it, it helped. So, let's say this. Let's say I got the. I kill someone and I get The Rock as my lawyer. And I don't have him well, look no, up any law just, books. No, it, it's not just charisma. You, like, you, so The Rock no, wouldn't no, be able to get no, me away with murder? No. No, you really need someone who fully, fully understands the law, because they can't have someone to be just, able to navigate the courtroom and stuff. Yeah. And you just have someone who can play a lawyer. <laughs> so Cochran, like, knew the law yes. and also yes. was charismatic. Right. Absolutely. Yeah, have you seen The Rock, though? Like, I mean, he's listen, really I think he fucking would be charismatic. Able to give you a less sentence, a not... lighter sentence, for sure. The Rock, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, he, but, okay. Just to be like... Calling the judge a candy ass, I just feel like <laughs> a Rudy uh, Pooh candy ass. You know, your I just honor, feel like your honor, candy ass. Yes. I'm nobody, gonna take the gavel, shine it up real nice. Yeah. It's like nobody cares what you have to think. <laughs> it doesn't. Yeah, judge, judge, what's your name? It doesn't. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, See, go and the well. jury would laugh and be like, ah, they're okay. You'd be like, In innocent, not guilty. That's oh my, my God, goal. If I ever go to trial for anything, hire the rock. <laughs> I'm going to use my rest. Twist. I might look. I don't think I can get Dwayne. Dwayne's a busy guy, but I do know a lot of wrestlers. 
Yeah. yeah. I think Biggie. I think Biggie could get me a much Biggie lesser charge. Biggie, Biggie could get me a much Biggie, lesser charge. Okay, Biggie, I actually legitimately think would get you a lesser charge for sure. Yes, yes. And he's the wrestler I talk to the most. So yes. Okay. I'm, I'm calling him up. <laughs> would you settle for a doink? Says not. No, doink. Doink's dead. He would suck. Yeah, and Doink would also get you a life in life in prison for yeah. life. You know, <laughs> the second he walked in the courtroom. Yeah. Yeah, like, put the handcuffs on him. And no, Doink. not so. Not Big E. Big E. Big E. Formerly Langston. I should have done a shield. I'm being. I'm playing carelessly. Super Nintendo. Sega yeah. Genesis. <laughs> Brock, Brock Lesnar would just eat the, eat the judge. Brock would be an intimidating one. Oh, I shit. Be, well, oh, shit. Yeah. Run away. Run away. His current lovable baby face, Brock Lesnar. Oh, of course, yeah. yeah. Hey, Texans, I'm just here to fight and a few things. I'm just, I'm just riding my tractor like an everyday farmer. Yeah, he's an everyday man, Brock yeah. Lesnar. Brock Lesnar, yeah. <laughs> I'm just a human like monster, you. Brock Lesnar, just like me. Create energy. <laughs> Oh shit, there's a little trapper. Don't trap me, please. Don't be a good little boy. Oh my god, how much? Come on. Alright, back to fighting this motherfucker. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus is right. So, yeah, no, it was during Ferris Bueller's Day Off. He was filming that oh, when the crash wow. happened. And it, was, uh, and it was with Jennifer Grey. <gasps> uh, she was in was the car? Secret. Wow. And that's how they, they got revealed that they were dating. She uh, had a severe whiplash and required surgery to avoid paralysis. Oh, my God. I had no idea about any of this. Well, I didn't know that it was that severe. And uh, he had, like, a collapsed lung and a concussion. Uh, Brock, uh, Broderick told the police he had no recollection of the crash and did not know why he had been in the wrong lane. He was he drove he drifted into the wrong lane. He probably, aye, aye, he probably aye, fell aye, asleep. Aye. Oh. I was in a car accident with my mom once. It's scary. She uh she had whip lanes in there and she got a bunch of glass in her forehead. Oh, he was in the UK. So he probably just drove in the wrong lane because he's an American. Uh, oh I, yeah. Is it that is it that simple? Probably. Uh, the, fan, the victim's family called it a travesty of justice, which it does feel like, yeah, that sucks. Oh, I like their little suction cup feet. Yeah, they're cute. Yeah. Can I, I've never tried to kill one of these. Uh-oh. You could kill one of these guys. Why do you, just from the back, you look super Brendan Fraser. I was going to say I look like, uh, Crispin Glover a little bit. Oh, yeah, I got that. It's the haircut, yeah. Yeah. Thanks, you've seen thanks, that Kristen Glover Mitch. on. Uh, I, I'm, you've I'm, seen the Kristen Glover on Letterman thing, right? Oh yes. Yeah, M Mitch right. is right. That was the segue of all segues. Thank so you like, very much. Oh, I tried to, I tried to do it. It's, it's insane. I can't just jump over those motherfuckers. You're right. You were just like punt them. Just basically drop kick them into the next room. Th this gets so pointless because it's always just you can the shoot same them, way but out. you can't hit them with your melee weapons. Mike oh, just played this game, so oh why? Oh, he did. Yeah. Yeah. He was. He played it for Halloween. Oh, he's People trying to. In the chat. Okay. It says right. Leo DiCaprio from Romeo and Juliet. You can see that too. Yes. Oh, yes. It's it's basically the, the '90s protagonist hair. Um, yeah. Especially in like all animated movies. Oh, I just shot one point blank. Sorry, little guy, but you're going to a better <laughs> place now. Like a Leon Kennedy haircut. Mm hmm. Yeah, they could put this guy on the cover of game magazines for sure. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Popple Tree, I watched this week's Andor, and oh boy. It's good, I heard, huh? Oh, it's incredible. It is. Who's incredible. behind it? Uh, Tony Gilroy and his brothers. So, the guy that did uh, Michael Clayton and um, Nightcrawler. And, oh, that um, Jake Gyllenhaal movie? Yeah. Yes, and they're That's like a good movie. Yes, and the, these are the guy and um uh, the creator of one a creator of one a major prestige television show is just like a staff writer on the show. They are writing the hell out of it. It is so goddamn good. Um, there's been so many.
things that try to show the start of the rebellion. This is the first one that shows like why people felt the need to rebel against the empire in the first place, and they just nail it. It's well, they're evil. Stuff. Look at the emperor. Yeah, yeah, right. Look at the empire. Emperor was like the whole thing before, and now it's like, well, look at what the empire does to just normal people, and ooh, it is. Uh, it, on, it's uh, most comparable to. Um, uh, un uncut gems and how I feel watching oy, the show oy, right oy, now. Oy, really? Okay, never yes. mind. You're selling yes. me. Here we go. Pick up your head. Oh, uncut gems. <laughs> yeah, but I, but I'm not gonna like voluntarily watch that movie again. I would love. to. I do not understand everyone saying it was like hard to watch. Like I was enthralled the entire time. Because you because you're just a different guy. Like you. you... <laughs> Not an answer. No, I mean like there's something missing in your in your brain that tells you to like be uncomfortable with that. Huh. Maybe that's why movies don't make me sad. Because I also don't get like stressed with yeah. cut gems. Maybe yeah, I just don't so, feel bad emotions. No, movies. you're just a sociopath. Like there's yeah, you, just, don't, you, you don't have. No, empathy. I feel I feel emotions. Yeah, I have sure. all sorts of emotions. I was uh, I mean. It's not as intense as Uncut Gems, but it, it, it's, it's doing the same vibes. Um, I was just like watching almost in the fetal position today because they're, <laughs> they're, they're showing like this this prison segment uh, and um, the guy, the, the, it's about Cassie Andor from Rogue One and uh, he just did this thing that got him arrested, which is a light spoiler, but whatever, just deal with it, everybody. Uh, it got him arrested and when he's in there, he found out one of the things, uh, another thing he did, un unrelated to what got him arrested, is causing everyone in prison's sentences to get extended sort of indefinitely. And the prison itself is this terrifying construct of like, you know, it's, it'll, you'll get electrocuted if you don't produce enough stuff when they're trying to uh, make these gizmos or whatever. Car? Uh, you know, it's car? Yeah, no, they're not making like Mandalorian armor, but, but you know, it doesn't really matter what they're making. It's just, like, it's just terrifying. Um, so yeah, it's just really, really good stuff. No, I don't know. No, says get the rest. Getting the rest of he was probably the show's lowest point. I don't. I, you mean like lowest as in emotional low point? Yeah, but I mean it's he got arrested for nothing, and that was the whole the whole point. I don't know. It's really good stuff. Uh, it, Andor is what we're talking about in Tomo. Sounds pretty uh, kid friendly. <laughs> I I wonder like yeah, it's not exactly the Star Wars Clone Wars. I love. Where it's like I just love how like watch. they had to get Star Wars to a place where like they're like. It's just awful. Like they had to, they had to figure out a way. Like that was always the thing with Star Wars. And in my like head, kind of was like, Star Wars is fine, but like at least it's not like horrifically graphic, and anyone can kind of watch it. But they're like, no, nah, we'll, we'll get there. Well, it's not graphic. It is just, um, it's like hard to explain, but it's just emotionally fraught. Like you, if you were to tell stories about uh, the oppression of the British Empire and colonies, that's what it feels like. Got it. Well, but it's, you know, they like gesture at things that are like the Boston Massacre, but it's not, sh they're not showing anything that is exactly the Boston, well, maybe a little bit, but not as graphic as, as something like that. I think I beat the chapter, boys. Yeah, boy. Nice. He's like, oh, I'm your density. Is that a Nick Cage impersonation? No, it's Crispin it's... Glover from Back to the Future. What are you uh... Oh, the ground. What is happening? Oh, there's flies. You are like the buzzing of flies. This, what is... Oh, got another lobster claw. Lobster's pretty good. Is it another one or is it the cell? Oh, boy. Ooh. Beat the chapter, uh, oh, maybe not that. quite yet. Yeah, no, this is... I got crushed by this guy last chapter. Like, oh, how's this guy going to There you go. Yeah, just shoot bullets at that. <laughs> I listened to that podcast too, Propaganda Panda. <laughs> Three hour episode about one episode, yes. What's that? It's uh it's Austin's Star Wars podcast. Oh. Oh cool. You're oh um, am I fighting this thing now? Is that what we're doing? He's dropping blue magic, so RGB, so should you be using green enchant and stuff? Yeah. Oh shit, I have to fight right now? I'm not in the mood for this. Um <laughs> It takes me like a week and a half to go through a one hour podcast. I have no idea how all these people listen to like 19 long podcasts. I just, I need podcasts to uh, do chores and stuff. I can't do anything without something playing because I need like a little bit of dopamine to get me through cutting the lawn or doing the dishes or taking out the trash. So I'm just kind of always listening to it when I'm doing stuff around the house. Oh, and someone brought me to Mexico to see that. I remember yeah. when I was in New York City, I was a lot of podcasts. It was crazy. 
I don't think I'm gonna be able to enchant this, but let's see. There we go. Some, <laughs> Some Wild West there. bullshit there? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you talk now? Alright, what are we doing here? And he's just talking shit, too. He's like, like you're gonna die, it. and I'm okay, not. Okay, okay. Uh, Alright, well, he's got these balls, which are really not that hard to dodge. Uh, You should... Yes, the, the ball... Apparently, you could attack him. Using dodgeable protect projectiles? I don't I don't really know how, what on. that means. I can aim at the ball, so maybe... Okay. See uh, what that's like. And then when he flashes, I think you can do a magic attack. Um, a level three magic attack. Okay. A sign. Well, that's that's only a level one, though. No, it's level three. No, it's oh, a three point, but it's not a level three. You want the big daddy one. Yeah, we need the big boy. I gotta make it. Um. Alright, remember Anterbach. Anterpor Anterbach Regamore. Anterbach Regamore. It sounds like I'm talking with marbles in my mouth. <laughs> so it's blue, so we'll do R. Uh, Anterbach. Wait, no, does, isn't blue, uh, RGB. R so oh, does, right. Isn't it green. green. Yeah. Anterbach. And then Regamore. So Anterbach. There you go. And then Pargon. 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 A sign. You guys excited for Vampire Survivors on Xbox? I actually, I am. Uh, mostly because I just want more people to play it. <laughs> Me too, and I also just want to start again and have an excuse yeah. to like, let's do it again with achievements. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that did gonna, nothing. You, 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 you gotta get closer. You gotta get closer. Alright, well at least all this running around is gonna give me back my uh, magic. <laughs> oh, I can't hit the uh, balls. I you right in the dick. Oh, can't hit the balls. Yeah, maybe just dodge. I don't know. Oh, I really got wow. eaten up there. Right. He's hitting you with those big fat do uh, dodge balls. Not closer timing off, I think. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll, I'll get there, folks. I'll get there. Do not get too close, but close in slightly is what the walkthrough says. Sure, sure, so, sure. slightly. All right. Give me your best balls. <laughs> if you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. I wonder if that movie holds up. Oh, Probably shit. Probably not. That wasn't right, enough. Comedy from Come on. 2010s or whatever. Yeah, and I remember. Yeah, it's like no, no, 2000s. 2000s. Right, you 2000s. know what? I need to make a fucking tinier one. I remember thinking Dodgeball looked terrible and thinking it was better than I expected, but I don't yeah, really like loving it. I think it, so too. You know? Oops. Oh, Arwolf says, I doubt it was intentional, but Vampire Survivors picked a great time to have the second wave of popularity with regards to Game of the Year discovery. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Oh, Grub, Grub mm -hmm. do I sense a deadly alliance with us? Uh huh. <laughs> Play that seed now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm feeling that game right now recently, too. It's just... It fits I never you. stopped feeling it. Yeah, it's what I need. <laughs> God damn it. What? I have no energy. <laughs> this is... like, what are you doing? Are you fighting me, or what are we doing? Why are you, why oh, are you doing shit. that dance? This isn't making me uncomfortable. I, this is fucking frustrating. Oh, my God. Do a little dance. Make a little magic. Kill God tonight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got, I got, got. <laughs> Just whips you in the back. Ooh. It's a funny game. It's funny. <laughs> I still can't cast this shit. No way. It's the the blue is your magic, right? Yeah. Okay. That's, there's not a lot there. I'm trying. I'm trying. Is there like a thing I can do? Oh, oh yeah, a mana recovery spell. Now how does that make me. sense? Uh, new spell. Wait, what like is wishing for more wishes. Summon trapper spell. Summon zombie shield. Damage shield. Enchant. Recover. Recover blue. There you go. Uh, Hammond of Texas asks, uh, is uh, Top Gun Maverick a cool guy movie? It's yes. one of the coolest guy movies. Yes. 
It is. I watched it. I've watched it like four or five times already. I only saw it the one time in the theater, but it was quite good. As soon as I came home, I'm like, just gotta put it on the background. Yeah, it was a good 4K that one. Technically, I can do this forever. Mike Tyson's gonna be on AW this week. Oh, really? Let's go! Yeah! Yeah, got him. Eat it. Got him right in the nut. Oh shit, I have 10 minutes. All right. I bet this is the first and only phase of this fight. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Wait, what? What? I thought, I thought, I thought. Do you not have enough magic to cast the spell to get more magic? I don't, how could that like, I, should, I don't listen. This, the, okay, math this is, the math doesn't make this sense. Is stupid. This part's stupid. Okay. All right. Battlefield right. Earth ass camera angle. <laughs> oh, how did that get me? Oh shit! I'm really getting fucked up right now. Battlefield Earth is like a tr truly worse than you could even expect. It, it, is it really is. So mindless. It feels so much longer than it is. Yeah. It is so fucking stupid. It's this got the Scientology angle. Mm -hmm. Travolta acting like he thinks this is the most prestigious thing he's ever done while looking like a complete dipshit. Yes. It, and, it, and, and overacting. Oh. Harder than anyone's overacted. Which Man animal. Oh, oh my <laughs> god. It, it's I mean, at least he does ham it up because that part is fun, his acting. Uh, but boy, it's bad. It's so fun. It. Honestly, it really might be the worst. Like, if we're talking like real movies, not like some pandemic in the room type thing right. that some weirdo put together. That was a good one. I would oh, have to oh, say oh. Battlefield Earth is the worst. Thing. Oh, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm struggling to think of anything worse. <laughs> yeah, I did hate the Matrix Resurrections, but Battlefield Earth is probably worse. Oh, a net on Amazon might be. It's up there, but. Yeah. Oh. People, people like a net, right? Is that, is oh, that yeah. the thing with that? Oh, like seven minutes yeah. standing ovation at like the Cannes Film Festival. Yeah. Right. Yes. Okay. The most insufferable. Okay, it, that's the most insufferable thing I've ever seen. Battlefield Earth is the worst movie I've ever seen. No, Exodal in the chat is saying Alien Resurrection. No, I'm saying The Matrix Resurrection. Sucked ass. Yeah, those are bad. Really bad. Uh, I thought Matrix Resurrections was more fun to think about than to watch, which is yes, for a Matrix movie. Yes. Okay. Come on, go blue. Why can't he go blue? What's happening? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Oh boy. Uh, another monster starts so many waves of zombies in groups of three. A little while after the zombies appear, the guardian flashes briefly and is vulnerable. All Do right. not attack the zombies, all caps. Cool. Instead, head to the right side of the battlefield where the second and third zombies appear last. And when the guardian flashes its vulnerability after set amount of time passes, cast the three point magic magical attack. Make sure that the guardian and not a zombie is the closest target where the magical attack strikes the zombies instead. It says don't attack the zombies? I don't know. Yeah, no, oh, okay. Wait. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's like a waste of your time. I don't know. Oh, uh, it did say this time. It, man, I just got two ooh, you times. Got squash. Yeah. Uh, it, this time it does say use the three point magical attack. All right. Oh, fucking Christ. What was it? Don't you already have this three point match? I don't attack? think I have the three point. I think I have the, the five and the seven. Okay. It's Antarok and Red Gamor. Oh, 
Oh, and now I gotta fucking. Did, were you using the IGN guide, Mike? I'm gonna try to review Mike. Mitch, Mitch, we're using Fine. the uh, IGN guide. Okay, all right. So then, Mike, you just tell us what to do. I mean, what the hell are we paying you to be in chat for? Yeah, come on. Dude, I have no energy for nothing right now. I'm in trouble. <laughs> I'm gonna have to stop soon too. We're gonna have to do this next time. Dr. Sanchez with <laughs> why they say Mitch and Mike. <laughs> oh my God. Cause Mitch is in this bitch. <laughs> That's correct. Yeah, you, I don't think you should get this close. Yeah, seems like it. Seems like it's a it bad idea. Seems like idea. it sucks. All right, that's gonna do it, folks. Yeah, all right, we'll come back fresh and, and beat this guy next time. You got a save, right? Like we're good. I have a good save. Let's just all make right. sure. I mean, let's just see where it loads up. I think I do. Oh, it took you forty minutes. Okay. <laughs> oh okay. no. Okay. 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 All, right. all right. Well, there's always next Wednesday. Yep. Let's just make sure we're we're good where we load here. Dr. Sunships, uh, Mike Benati is, is, doesn't exist. We're, we only know Mitch Talcoto. Yeah. Keep it kayfabe, folks. Yeah. Come on. Big money, big money, no whammy. Okay. All right. It's the key. Yep, we're good. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to do it. Oof. Thank you so much, Jeff Bacalar. Thank you so much, Jeff, Jeff Grubb. Bacalar. And Dan, you were here too. Uh, I was here. Ladies and gentlemen, what else we got going on today? Let's, uh, let's, you know what, let's wrap this up and, and for the VOD and then we'll talk about it. Okay. Until yeah. next time, this has been Eternal Darkness. At the heart of my soul, which is very darkness-y. We'll see you next time. And very eternally. Of course. Here. <laughs> I know. Bye-bye. <laughs>